We are back and this weekend we are taking an impromptu trip to Lake Tahoe to capture all the magic of summer with our puppy. We drove in Friday night and set up camp at Sugar Pine Point Campground. It's located in Edsburg, Sugar Pine Point State Park on the west shore of Tahoe. The park has 2,000 acres of thick forest consisting of juniper, pine, fir, and blankets of aspen. Hey guys, so we are here in Lake Tahoe taking a hike. We're doing the Lake Genevieve and Craig Lake via the Meeks Bay Trailhead. It's a dog friendly hike. It's about 9.8 miles and we have a lot of up life updates for you, but here's the first one. This is our puppy Harvey. He's eight months and we adopted him from a rescue in Modesto. The hike is less than 10 minutes from Sugar Pine Point Campground. It's a 9.8 mile out and back trail that you can enjoy with your dog. It starts at the Meeks Bay Trailhead and follows the Meeks Creek North Trail to the Tahoe Yosemite Trail. just moved on to the Tahoe Yosemite part of the trail and Shailen and Harvey are just flying away. If you have a small dog, using a backpack carrier is great for hiking. We carry Harvey in the backpack for most of the journey. Harvey was able to look around or curl up for a nap when needed. We recommend getting your dog used to their carrier by leaving it out and around your house before bringing them on a hike in it. That way it can feel like a safe space or a home away from home for your dog. And always bring lots of water and some food for your pet on adventures. We just stopped by this beautiful waterfall and we're just taking a minute to enjoy it. It's gorgeous. This whole hike has been really beautiful, but it did just start raining and that wasn't in the weather forecast. So we'll see how we go, but it is nice. It's cooling things down quite a bit, which I think Harvey will really enjoy. The hike is captivating. There are epic views all around us of lush forest, rock formations, and vibrant wildflowers. Bright red snow plants and purple lupines pop up all around the trail. The sound of the waterfall carries and we can hear woodpeckers and mountain chickadee chirps echoing through the forest. There is a lot of mosquitoes at the top of the trail and the rain gets heavier up there as well. So we started back down the trail quickly. So it's actually thundering and lightning a little bit here. So our plans might have to drastically change. We were gonna go swimming and now we will see about that. Yeah, we'll see how it goes. Harvey did take a nice little nap and that was great. So now we're continuing on and it's gonna be fun. really lucked out and the sun came back out so we're gonna jump in the water and go for a little swim How's the water, lady? It is freezing cold. Harvey would only dip his paws in. <laughs> but he's really enjoying playing with the waves. Yeah, and he seems to be really enjoying sunbathing as well. He's a sunbathing beauty. <laughs>
beach is the perfect spot to lounge in the shade of towering trees and dip into the cool, clear waters of Tahoe. It's a 10 minute drive from the hike. We dip in and out of the water and play fetch with Harvey. He loves playing with sticks. They're his favorite toy. He picks one up on every walk we take. So today was such an amazing day and it's so lucky that we're ending such a special hike and adventure in Tahoe on this beautiful beach. Yeah, we're at Sugar Pine Point Beach and it's beautiful and peaceful and you know what? Days don't always go as planned, but it's kind of part of the magic of adventuring. <laughs> got back to the campsite. We're gonna have a little kombucha. Cheers. Cheers. And cook dinner. We'll see you in the morning. Mmm. <laughs> this is super good. The black cherry is really good. We're gonna have to, yeah, we're gonna have to switch. This, this is, is also too. delicious. I think I, yeah. I like that one. <laughs> Classic. Harvey, are you ready for dinner? I think someone's a little hungry. Harvey! <laughs> that dirt on his nose. <laughs> We're having a little too much fun. sleep. Oh, you're all cozy. Hmm? Harvey. <gasps> Good morning. Good morning. <laughs> Good morning, Harvey. <gasps> oh, look. It's a beautiful day. It's a beautiful day. Today we're on the Fallen Leaf Lake Trail. It's a pretty short little trail, but it's a gorgeous spot for swimming. And we already jumped in. Yup, it's gorgeous. We had quite a night last night. There was a bear at our campsite trying to get into our neighbor's cooler. So not a lot of sleep, but we're trying to enjoy the day. Yeah. Oh my God, it's freezing. <laughs> Ooh, Harvey wants to come in. Harvey! <laughs> so last night around 3 a.m. we heard, <laughs> Shaylin woke up first I should say, we heard a loud, loud bear trying to break into our neighbor's bear cooler. Um, it was terrifying. I mean, bears definitely don't want to hurt you, but they do want to get food and things can happen by mistake. So. We stayed up for quite a while. We were up pretty much until 6 a.m. and then we took an hour nap, um, just listening and trying to make noise when the bear came by. So I have to admit the water is pretty icy, but we did get Harvey to go in with us for a quick little swim too. It is absolutely beautiful here. 
Spending time in the natural world is inherently rewarding. It calms our nervous systems and creates a surge of positive emotions. Nature inspires creativity and cultivates a sense of calm and connection. The blooms of summer are the essence of real magic. If you can take some time to forest bathe this summer, let us know how it goes. What do you feel when you're forest bathing? So, Shannon, this trip has been amazing. What was your favorite part? Was it seeing a bear in real life? Nope, that was <laughs> my favorite part, although I have seen a couple bears in my life, but I will say it was probably seeing Harvey have fun on the beach and swim with us. Oof, yes, definitely. <laughs> Harvey, are you having fun? <laughs> He's so dirty, dude. Best day! <laughs> Such an adventure weekend. <laughs> The sun is still high, but we have to hop back on the road and get back to the city. We have about a four hour drive. Harvey does not want to leave though. Come on. We look forward to sharing our next adventure with you soon. Please like, comment, and subscribe to our channel. Thank you.